Name's Jake. Welcome to my world. One. I'm standing outside Groom Lake at the edge of what is rumored to be a top secret Air Force base, although the government has always denied its existence. For some reason, air activity and radio traffic in the area is at its highest in recent memory, leading to speculation that the government covers up. When I was a kid, I loved to blow things up. Plastic army men were my favorite. The year is 2026 and I've changed. A little. I'm a special task force marine in the explosive division. Much to my wife's disapproval. Only now I defuse bombs. Before they blow my brains out. What a rush. I received a call early this morning for my next mission. I hate being woken up before noon. See, it's your standard defuse and run, only this time the explosives aren't going to be popped in any ordinary building. They're in a classified place where the government hides anything that might disturb the average Joe. I know a little about it because my father worked there until his death 15 years ago. He died in a plane crash on the way to work along with 10 other scientists. Or so they said. I was only 9 when it happened. The strange thing is that two days ago I received a phone call from a man who refused to tell me his name. He told me he was a friend of my father's and that soon I'd be learning more about his death. The next day I was assigned to this top secret mission. Inside a place called Area 51. There are things I like about my job, and things I don't. I hope you had your beauty sleep, Private, because you need it! What's the situation, sir? A scientist has placed major explosives on the first two levels of the base! He's threatening to blow them up if we don't meet his demands! Your mission is to defuse these bombs! If you look at files, talk to anyone, or even go to the bathroom before you defuse these bombs, I will take one of these explosives and shove it right up your... I understand, sir. You must avoid being seen by any flying security cameras in the base. If they spot you, the scientists will blow this base up. Do you understand? Yes, sir. They're trying to keep something in or out. Hey, what's with the escort service? This is Marine Commander Black Dawn. He and his men are going to clean things up after you complete your mission. You will contact me and let me know after you defuse the explosives. Understood? Yes, sir. What's your major malfunction, Private? Say it like a Marine! Yes, sir. Move out! It's showtime. Security camera active. Security camera active. Did you hear this? He's not giving us much time. Yeah, you're right. We have to move quickly if we're gonna be the first to get the interview. Where are you? I'm on level four. Fitz is sending someone to meet us. I'll be there soon. We're dead! A 
the matter with you? Security camera. I hunger. What do you expect? It's fun to it. Hey man, listen to this. We now have confirmed reports that the body of Elvis has been seen inside the base. Earlier we asked a local farmhand why he thought the military would want his body. Well, isn't it obvious? They want to bring him back from the dead to wiggle his hips for one last time. Turn that crap off. Hey, just trying to have some fun. No time for that. London Bridge is falling down. New Kim. Helps boo boos heal real fast. Access denied. Look, it's not my fault, okay? Blame the one with the controller. I can't believe Fitz is going to give us this interview. I've waited a long time for a break like this. I found something on level three. You won't believe this, but... Robert? <laughs> Maintenance robot activated. That looks like a big gun for a small twerp like you. London Bridge is falling down. I've fallen and I can't get up. Level one. Game over. 